today we are exploring this abandoned classic car scrapyard. Just found a Morris Traveller. This is a super rare Citroen Diane. Fiat 500. Wonder how long this Renault 5 has been here for. Just found another Fiat 500. Look at the old Triumph. Welcome back to the channel, welcome to today's video. And as you can see, I'm joined with Stokesy. Obviously. <laughs> Today we've come to look at a classic car scrap gun. Some of these cars have been here for a long time. I'm told there's some really good ones as well. So let's go check it out and see what we can find. Okay guys, so we are now in here. And the first vehicle we come across is this. Now, any ideas what it is, Stu? <laughs> Bedford. Bedford. What's left of it? <laughs> Guys, look at this. These cars have been here for 50 years plus. <laughs> Got to have been. Is that a Jaguar or a Daimler? Or is it something completely different? It is actually a Humber. A Humber? Yeah. Humber. Wow. Really is that a little Anglia next to it as well, I think? I mean... This is this is just artwork now, isn't it? They're not cars anymore. They're just something that resembles a car. Yeah, yeah. God, look how many there are. <laughs> it's crazy. It's an old Rover there. Sheldon, another one for you there, look. God, they have literally just crumbled, haven't they? They have crumbled and fallen apart. It's so cool though, it really is cool. Um, <laughs> what way do we go? That way, oh my Ooh. god. Okay, so this is gonna be quite interesting in here today. I'm trying to fight my way through the trees. Wow, god. Ford Escort, 45. Ooh. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. There's got to be at least 50 cars here. <laughs> it's mad. Absolutely mad. Well, I don't even know what half of them are because you can't tell. Oh my goodness. Well, we know that's an escort because we can see it's an escort. It's got it written on the back there. That's really cool, that is. I like oh, that. What one? That's what one. Oh, there's a dead rat on the bonnet of that one. Oh, be careful I tread because um, it's not very safe in here. Ooh. Oh, this is an old um, Citroen 2CV, isn't it? Or is it a Diane? It's a Diane, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, look at that. That is so that cool. Would be a really cool photograph. It would be. It yeah, yeah. Do you know what? I thought that was a rat, but it's not. It's the the leg of something else. Chicken. Shit, it's definitely not a chicken. If that was a chicken, <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm going to try and do this as carefully as possible. Oh, God. In fact, 
I might not even be able to go this way. I might have to find another way. Unless I can stretch over. This is really not easy. This is so... Yeah, it stinks, doesn't it? This is so difficult. Is that a sheep, do you reckon? What's happened is the lamb's died. So it's crawled off of it. Fox has got it. Because there's badger holes here, badger fox holes. Yeah. That's food, that is. Yeah, it is. It stinks, doesn't it? Yeah. It's not good. Is that a capri there? That looks like a capri, that purple no, one. It's a boxhorn. I can't think of the name. Definitely a boxhorn. Wow. There's a Rover P6 over there, I think, in the corner. Just about to see it, uh, like that. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> this is madness. This is absolutely madness. This place has got to have been closed like 30 years plus. Yeah. Right, it's just impossible to, to move around without hurting yourself. Way, Do you know what? I think I have. I just wanted to have a look up here and see see what was up here. Oh. <laughs> There's a prop shaft just sticking <laughs> sticking out the ground there. Look. Oh wow! Some of these are so cool. <laughs> All right, this is where I need to be careful because I don't want to fall over and land on anything sharp sticking out the ground because that is a possibility in here it really is i mean just look at these cars guys these cars you know they have been here for so long i mean they have literally become part of nature they really have i mean this look if i just stand here there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty cars just around me where I am here. This looks like an old Morris, yes it is, look at that. I can't open the door because it'll fall off. Look at the mould on that steering wheel. It's, it's beautiful, it really is. It's beautiful. It's lovely. It looks so cool. There's another Morris there. Oh, wow. This is one of those places where you just admire what they used to be. There's not really anything worth saving on them. There really isn't. Maybe a little bit of glass here and there, but you know what I mean? It's just it's just not worth it. Just let them rest in peace. Wow, there's an old bike over there. I wonder if we can get to that. God. Look at that. How cool is that? Wow. <laughs> there's another van there. There's a, a recovery truck just there. You can just about see that. There, the yellow one. <sighs> Morris 1100 badge there. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, I'm going to try and... <laughs> there's a steering wheel there, look. Wow. Let's try and get back to where Stu is and have a look at the cars over that side that we haven't seen yet. Oh. Okay, so I've made it over here. There's the Citroen Diane we saw earlier. Um, I've managed to squeeze through all of this next to the Vauxhall, which is here. And um, we've got another Escort just there. Is that an estate? Yeah. Wow. Not to Escort estate. estate. That is that an old Rover? No, I think it's a Morris. 
Ugh. Ugh. There's something dead on the floor there. Oh, that's part of it. A lamb, isn't it? Ugh. Oh, it stinks. There's bits of animals everywhere. It's not a bar now, is it? That? Oh, there's a dead crow there too. Oh, it's Stu. Wait. This is like wrong turn, isn't it? It is, mate. Ooh. Dead cars. We're going to get some hillbilly with no teeth and a funny face come and chase us out in a minute. I hope not. Me too. <laughs> oh, dear. That's got a super badge on the side of it. Wow. Wow. That is cool. Leyland badge on the steering wheel. Look at the old Rover. God, Sheldon, you're going to love that. She's dead though. Ain't no saving her. There ain't no saving her. God. Oh, that does stink. I'm not going to show you guys too much of it because I know you don't want to see it, but. Whew. God. <laughs> it's a nightmare. Like, literally, trying to maneuver through this is just. Yeah, it's not good. Look through here, look. There's cars all the way through there too. There's a mini clubman there, look. Oh my God, this is crazy. Are you all right there, mate? <laughs> He's trying to get a picture. So look, where we're standing at the moment, I'm just gonna show you guys. We've got the Escort, the Vauxhall. We've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I could see at least 11 cars just in this little corner. Oh my God. Right, I'm gonna try and get to where you are, Stu, if you're done. Mm. Try and do a swap if we can. Mm. So just a quick peek inside the Escort. Oh, look, I've got a tall chest in there. Hey, look at the old steering wheel, how cool is that? Wow. Do you know I do like these? They are nice cars. They're really cool, aren't they? Yeah. God, look. Literally as far as you can see. Do you know what? I think we have to come back here in the winter time when there's not so much uh, foliage around. Okay, so we're gonna try and head in this direction, but Stu's just done a bleh. So I'm guessing there's something else up here that's not very nice. <laughs> <laughs> what on earth is that? That's a flipping deer's leg. <laughs> Where's the rest of the deer? I don't know. Oh, there's the Rover P6 and then the other one buried in there somewhere. Can't even see it from here, actually. This recovery truck's cool. I really, really like this. But like I said earlier, guys, this this is a little bit creepy. It's like, it's like wrong turn. It really is, where you come to the bit where they find all the bones. This this is really strange. Is that an owl? Nah. It looks fresh, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. It smells fresh. Hmm. I've trying all my breath around here. Okay, so we're just uh, negotiating a way through. I've just caught a glimpse, actually, as I was saying that. There's a Renault 5 through there, a little, little red one. Hopefully we can try and get around to that in a minute. That looks like a Peugeot van. Is it a Peugeot? No, it's Leyland, so it's a... Uh... No, it's not. Oh, God. Land Rover. God, there's so much stuff here. This was probably quite a popular business back in the day. There's a mini engine there, is it? Well, it's an A-series engine. I don't think it's from a mini, though. Wow, the Land Rover's pretty cool. Look at that. Wow. Do you know what? I don't think this is a Land Rover, is it? Or is it? <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't know if that is a Land No. I don't think it is. Oh, God. Oh, Stu's doing a register. We're going to find out. Wow, look at that. 
Nah, it's probably been that long, isn't it? It's, um, yeah, it won't be on there anymore. Oh, that is so cool. Look at the old Triumph. It is a lost in, I thought it was. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was. Wow. I oh, know there's an old Woody Traveller in there. Oh my God. God, this place has been empty for years. That could probably be safe though, to be fair. It doesn't even look that bad. But sadly, the, the place is falling down around it. All right, let's head back in this direction. I didn't actually look at this earlier. This is, oh, there's a plane there, look. Huh, it's pretty cool. Um, Rickman Ranger. Rickman Ranger. Never heard of one. Must be quite a rare thing. That's another P6 there. Oh my God. And look at this Escort. Look what someone's done to this Escort. <laughs> They've butchered it. <laughs> they have literally butchered it. Oh, what a shame. That is a real shame. So this is a perfect example of um, someone's business that's literally just got too old and um just 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 has left it to be honest look at all this stuff in here no one's been in here for years nobody cares about it anymore and it is a shame really but that's life unfortunately if there's nobody to pass it on to if that person isn't capable of doing it anymore then sadly there's no other option it's a cool little van like that. Oh yes, it's still got an engine in it. Just about. <laughs> right, let's head in this direction. Oh my goodness me. This is unbelievable. And this stuff is literally just falling into the ground. It's just falling into the ground. Transit. Oh wow, I've just seen a 3500 through there. Can I get across this without it breaking on me? Yes. Oh my God, look at the Fiat 500. Oh my God. Oh, that is such a shame. Look at that. Okay, now I'm sad, that shouldn't be here, that really shouldn't be here, but there we go, right, let's head back this way, okay so we're now going to try and attempt to get to the cars through here that we haven't seen yet, and look at that, we are greeted with a Renault 5, that is cool. That is an early one. Yes. And look at this, the wing has oh, fallen off the car and it's literally laying on the grass, on the grass, on the ground. Look at that. That's mad. Absolutely mad. Absolutely bonkers, mate. Bonkers. Absolute bonkers. I tell thee. That's a four door repair. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Zodiac. What you've got to do now. That's a Zodiac. Oh shit, yeah. Yeah, mate, it's hard, isn't it? So, um. So me and Stu are currently at this level, on our knees almost. I'm mostly, to... I'm mostly on this level. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's, it's so difficult to manoeuvre around here. It really is. What are we going, that way? Yes. Right, going that way. Finished. Okay. <laughs> I've already done did it. It's door open on this Renault 5. To be honest, it's probably going to fall off in if I try and open it. Oh yeah, look at that. I didn't know it had suicide doors. Look. <laughs> oh yeah, the boot is open. Oh my god. 
Look at that. Get the camera in there. Wow. Oh, look, we've got a register. JVT623V. Oh, God, Bumblebee. Sorry. <laughs> Look at this. Okay, so we've made it to the Morris Oxford. Just about. Oh, actually, the trees are getting slightly high here, which is good. Ugh. I'm still getting caught up on all of them, though. This is so mad. <laughs> wow. P6. Oh, there's more dead animals in here. This is... What? Is that a lamb's leg there? Mate. Mate, there's bones everywhere. There's literally bones everywhere. We're right in the nest. Whatever is killing these animals, we're in its home right now. Look, there's a wing literally there on the floor right next to me. I really don't know what that could be. Fox? Badger? Mm, maybe not a badger. Wow, oh, I don't want to tread on any of it. That's definitely a lamb's leg down there. That's, um... Yeah. Look, there's feathers everywhere. There's bones. Ugh. Ouch. <laughs> Is that another three at 500? Oh. Oh no. Okay, I think I'm gonna cry now. There's a mini engine there. That is definitely 100% a mini engine. Oh, guys. Oh, there's a mini Clubman estate next to it as well. Look at the state of it. Look at the state of that. God, there's more. Honestly, this is really weird. Like, whatever's eating all of these animals is like spread it out everywhere. It's quite disgusting, actually. Look at the engine on this, look. It's literally just completely disintegrated. The rear engine cover, gone. That is such a shame. And look at the mini as well, that's been... <laughs> oh. But then let's face it guys, like back in the day when these cars were parked here, they, they were worth nothing, you know? They were worth absolutely nothing. And it's only because time's gone on, you know, they've become more desirable, more collectible, they're worth any money. But sadly, I don't think any of these cars are worth saving. I really don't. Look at the struts, look, the struts have actually come through and push the bonnet up in the air. Ooh. What have we got through here? God, it, honestly, it's never ending. Well, there's a wing there of a, it looks like an owl. I just can't believe how far back it goes. Oh, I don't know if we can go that way. I don't know if we can go that way either. Okay guys, I'm gonna try and negotiate a way around here. Bear with me. Okay, so we're almost at the back of this yard now. <laughs> it just amazes me, it really does. How these cars just fall apart like they do. You think something that used to carry people around in, you know, drive 70, 80 miles an hour on the motorway. Maybe not all of them, some of them. And now they're just crumbling. That is another Fiat 500. That's three. Three Fiat 500s we've seen here today. Oh. My God, I don't know what to say. I really don't. It's just, it's just such a shame. It really is. Wow, I mean, I've been to some places before, but I mean, for pure, you know, decaying artwork of cars, this place has got to be one of the best. <sighs> Look at the old Rover just completely taken over with Ivy. Oh, it's almost invisible. It's wearing an invisible cloak. <laughs> oh, if I can get to the back, got a little bit more breathing room here. Another Morris Oxford. A Morris 
across there. Look, that's a split screen as well. That's a really early one, that is. And that truck in now, I don't know what that truck was. That truck is non-existent now. Wow. So we've just made it into the last little corner, the collection we haven't seen yet. And um, Stu's photographing that, I think. I thought it was a Morris, but I don't think it is a Morris, is it? Yeah, so it oh, I don't actually know. Whatever it was, it was really cool. Yeah. Guys, if any of you know what that is, please pop it in the comments below, because we're not 100% sure. No. But we do know what this is. This is a Ford Capri, or it was a Ford Capri. It certainly was one. And um, as you can see, it's, yeah, it's not even worth saving. It's been completely stripped inside. There's no, well, there is a dashboard just about. Someone's actually cut this area out here, which I think is where the wing mirrors actually mount. So maybe they had a rusty patch on theirs and they wanted to weld a, a new bit in, possibly. An old rover here, look, standing behind me, or sitting behind me. That's really cool. Big old car. Really big car. A Renault 5? Yep. Is it a Renault 5, is it? Oh wow. I don't think you said this last time I came. Ah, it's quite difficult to get to, isn't it? Yeah. Oh yeah, look at that. God. Look at the moss on that car. Definitely a revisit. That is um I should have bought my camera. <laughs> wow, that is so cool. I can't be do you know what this reminds me of? The American car grave that we went to. Yes. All of the cars just covered in moss where they've been here so long. One of the best uh Great car graveyards today. So. Yeah, it really is. Stu, yeah. builder's bum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a newspaper in there, look. Shit. Yeah, look. Let's go back and have a look. Sorry, mate. What is it? There's a bed in there, too. There is a bed in there, too. You won't believe this. 1984. You look, that's, that's my you date of birth. Yeah. How crazy is that? Get what is it? The, the evening... Oh, it's Trials... Another, another double for Trials Dave. Times News, isn't it, or something? I have motorbikes. It's a motorbike, motorbike yeah. newspaper. That's pretty cool. That's really cool, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Jesus, 37 years old, that is. That's, yeah. that's mental, isn't it? You think about it. And it's been open to the elements. Has that, right? been, has that been there for 37 years, that newspaper? It's possible. Ooh. You think of all the weather we have here in the UK, the yeah. storms, the rain, the snow. If that newspaper has been sat there for that long... Yeah, but even in like the World Wars, there was always a new newspaper knocking about. Yeah. Newspapers are d indestructible. Yeah, they are. They really are. Yeah. And I can't believe that's actually the year I was born as well. You know, to find that in there like that is just... I was born in 81. No bastard. I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're trying to negotiate our way back out now. And I thought I would film it because it would be quite entertaining for you guys to watch. Us um, struggle. Yeah, we're trying to escape all the parties here, <laughs> Colin's derriere. Stuart, there's a Fiat 128 here. here. You didn't hear me. What's that? There's a Fiat 128 here. Oh, no, there isn't. Yeah, look. Oh, no way. <laughs> oh, my God. That is mental. Look at that. It's got a Dover sticker on the back of it. So that's probably been abroad, that car. Once upon a time, back in the day. Ouch. Okay, so we're gonna try and get out. Did we come this way? No, we didn't. Yes, we did, because there's the Escort. But I thought this was the Escort. No, this is a different one. It's a different Escort, yeah. This is a Mark 1 van, isn't it? I haven't it? even seen that one. The lights are gone, though. We were stood right next to it. We didn't even see it. Ah, uh, it's kind of understandable in here. <sighs> this is crazy, look at it. You ever heard of a boat? No. Not, a mo not the uh, magazine or the Range Rover. There's a car Vogue. No. Have you? Have you ever heard of another car called a Vogue? Yeah, Vogue? there's a Vogue there. Vogue? Yeah, a Vogue. V-O-G-U-E. I don't think so. No. Ow. Check out Arms Go to Cave, the end for the picture. <laughs> <laughs> Link will be in the description. <laughs> right. <laughs> God, this is really... Ouch. Ugh. Oh, we're back at the... the... Oh. Ah. oh, it went in my ear. Oh, it's stuck on my head. Ah. Ah. <laughs> right, I think it's time to get out of here now. 
Yeah, Colin <laughs> stops so I get him off of deadness. <laughs> Ouch! Ah! Ow! That hurt. That I've got a fawn. Look how deep that is in my arm. Can you see it? Is it focusing? It's not focusing, is it? Look how deep that is in my arm. Look how deep that is in my arm. <sighs> Oi. Ah. That hurt. I'm just going to put that on the bonnet. That was it there. That one there. Go on. Go away. Are you recording that, <laughs> I thought you were actually talking to me. <laughs> 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 deep is in my... <laughs> I did it. <laughs> right guys me and Sue are all done now hope you've enjoyed today's video please like and subscribe please go check out the instagram which is the beard explorer underscore and also go and check out the facebook page like always i put all the pictures on facebook i can hear him talking tell the best to instagram and i will link stokes in the description <laughs> below and we'll see you on the next video next week peace <laughs>